Hi, 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 hi. Welcome. I am Jay Ganesh. It can call me Jayush. And first of all, uh, before getting into the Python, I congratulate you because you have found the best tutorial for beginners in Python. This is my first tutorial. In this first tutorial, we'll see about introduction of Python and as well as installation for Python. So in order to make it clear, I have one presentation about Python. So I'll go inside it. Um, let's start our tour about it. Okay, now what is Python? First of all, when compared to other programming, the Python is a one of the best program because the reason is because Python is an interpreted object-oriented high-level programming language with dynamic semantics. What is interpreter? Interpreter means translate the program one statement at a time. If you are taking a compiler, it will compile all the programs and then only it will give you it will give you the exact output and it will be converted into the machine code. But interpreter, it will take one statement at a time. And what is high level programming? When a program when a program satisfied maximum number of condition and object oriented, that's why we call it as a high level programming. It's with dynamic semantics, obviously we know. Why Python? Python is first of all, it have a mixing of good features from Java, Perl and Scheme. And one of the main thing the users trying with the Python is very very easy to adopt the user to develop their own thoughts and as well as it's a powerful and portable it we can use this Python for scripting also one of the major for reduce the cost of programming the maintenance that is why we prefer the Python and next uh, advantages of Python so obviously Python is a powerful when compared to the other programming because even it's a uh, interpreter that's why the compile time is very very fast we'll get the output in very fast manner so we call it a powerful and fast place with well with others it runs everywhere I mean every platform is friendly and easy to learn and one of the best reason is it's a uh, open source because we can get help from any community of the Python and um, Python built-in data types each and every programming it have a built-in data types so similar wise have Python also will be having some set of friends I mean the built-in data types or uh, wow these four <laughs> the first one is list tuple dictionary and set we'll see about them in our upcoming tutorials and now we move to next next um, so what are the applications what are the applications we can use the python so obviously internet scripting artificial intelligence and database programming and image processing okay one of the major things is image processing i have used image processing i think because for machine learning and deep learning things yeah uh, okay you don't worry anymore to begin okay let's start about the python and before that we'll move to the installation for python i'll show you see once you're given a python in google it's obviously go the first link just go to the first link and it'll be getting this kind of stuff here and now i'm going download in a download windows is there in windows we'll be having a two tab python 3.6.2 and another one is python 2.7 and i highly recommend you to download python 3.6.2 because um, this have uh, many features to be worked with and so i highly recommend you to download python 6.2 uh, right now in my laptop i already installed the python 2.7 even though uh, I installed 2.7, I recommend you to download 3.6.2. And after you finish the formal 
installation you will be getting you can search in your search and you'll be getting idle python gui just double click it i think it takes some time yeah it's opened okay after it's open it will show you what are the customized thing 2.7.1 version december 27 the date it's installed and it's a 32 bit Intel and the corporate credit is all the information will be done. in order to check whether our python program is working i need to check like 3 plus 5 oh uh, it's working and i need more to check i start to oh my god it's working yeah okay guys thank you thank you so much i hope you like this tutorial in my next tutorial we'll be seeing about a python more and more stay hungry strive hard for better tomorrow thank you thank you so much bye bye see you